You, have you heard of the term bucket list? Yeah. What yeah, do you understand like, it to be? Well, it's things to do before you die, isn't it? We've sort of compiled a top hundred that we've taken from loads of, loads of lists, and these seem to be the most popular 100 things to do before you die. Anything you fancy there? Flying a fighter jet. Um, forget that. What's the sort of things you've heard of in the past as a typical bucket list? It's daft stuff. Right. Uh, skydiving. Mm -hmm. Bungee jumping. Why is that daft, though? Because it's not worth doing that sort of thing. I think it's dangerous. But why do you think people do it, then, if it's pointless? Because they're idiots. <laughs> sort of gel permed air types. Yeah. Australians, sort of... You're not jealous of their hair, are you? <laughs> no, I just mean it's that sort of... Yeah, they go, woo! Yeah, normally I'd avoid them. I'd go, yeah. I don't want to know them sort of people. Right, go down the list, OK. Well, I think you'll find that jumping out of a plane probably is on here, and there's his budget jumping, but there's obviously... Uh, there's a hundred options here of things to do before you die. I mean, like being on a private desert island, even though I'm not go. that interested... Right. I prefer that than doing the dangerous stuff. So, should we tick that? Spend a night on your own private desert island? Just at one night? But what am I doing, then? Just chilling out. Hanging out. It's, it'll be sunny, you just walk around naked. No, I wouldn't do like, that. Why? There's no-one there, just walk around, no, you know, I'll, like nature. No, Completely walk, naked, no, as God I intended. I wouldn't do it. I, don't, I, I wouldn't do that. Well, if you're doing that one, we're confiscating your pants when you land. Just because you never know. One not it Crusoe who was on there? And who? Friday cropped up. Who? Robinson Crusoe. Yeah. Yeah, well, he wouldn't have walked around with his knob out. Yeah, he didn't. Yeah. Friday cropped up. That's what I'm saying. You think no one's there. A boat comes in, a, a cruise with a load of tourists. I'm stood there with knob and bollocks out. Anyway, it's sand and that. It's not good to be nude in the sand. <laughs> nude. OK, uh, spend a night on your own desert island in your pants. Yeah? You can go a bit mad, though, can't you? <laughs> not in a day. Not in a day. <laughs> if I was there, you could. I've been on the world now for 38 years. I don't need to introduce this now. Oh, fucking hell. I'm just creating a new problem if I do get into bungee jumping. I don't want to change. I don't want to get into this. Can't oh, let it go. Look up. Bring that chin up. Focus on that mountain. Nah, forget yes. it. No. And you're going to die there. Nah, I don't want it. It's, it's so oh. Honestly, you'll be coming up saying, I need to do that See, again. What was that so noise? I, I just made a noise I've never heard come from me. Uh, there's that noise again. You're gonna go for no. this. Yes, you are. No. You have got it, mate. No. It's all yours. Looking up. No, nah, forget it. Forget come on, it. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. No, there's a queue. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I'm not this is your it. chance, bro. Man the fuck up. Man up, boy. Tough enough, snowflake. Come on. Right, stop talking a second. Just give me brain, just a chance to count myself in. <laughs> Do it. Just do it. Nah, forget it. I've, I've, yeah. Honestly, yeah, forget it. I've bottled it, I've bottled it. I'm going to go and see where the bungee was invented. Let's see what difference it makes about seeing where something was invented. It's not even a proper invention. It's not like a Dyson vacuum cleaner. It's going to be some nutter jumping off a tree with a bit of rope attached to his leg. It's not an invention. My feet haven't touched the ground. I can't believe I'm getting in another plane. I think I've been in the air more than some pigeons. Pigeons seem to walk about on land more than I've been doing the last two days. I thought EasyJet was bad. Look at this. Fucking hell. I'm here to see this land diving thing, which is, you know, it's like the birth of the bungee, isn't it? If I keep saying no to stuff, it's like, will it get worse? And I'm just thinking through my head about what this land dive is. If I don't do a land dive, what are they going to find for me tomorrow? It's like, Carl, get down to tarmac dive. Oh, no, 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 no. You bring me to these places and expect, you know, just for me to fit in. Look at that for an image. And you're just dropping me in it. So, you will do it. Definitely not. No. Are, they, are these people expecting me to do it from the top? Yeah. They want you to do it to the top. Yeah, but why, why? I got there, did the proper land dive. After, they were all, like, carrying me about, the local village all throwing me about in the air. 
They were loving it. Done it. Did you do, did you do the real one or did you do the child's version? But how high was it? I think you've got to be honest Yeah, with I know, it. how high? How high? It was the one below the child's one. It's about four, four foot, Carl. It was about... It was about five foot. Five foot? Sorry, I high jumped higher than that. No, it, I think it was about five and a half foot. <laughs> Seriously, how many more flights have we got to do on this? Because it's I think it's getting out of hand. I haven't even had my bag unpacked since I've been here. It's just been jumping on a plane, off a plane, on a plane, and now I've got to get to another island to get on another plane to get to another island. It's just doing me head in. It doesn't even make sense, this place, Vanuatu. 82 islands make it up, don't they? I mean, what? how does that work? It's just in bits. It's like it's been blown up. It is weird, isn't it? I mean, here they are, proper tribe, you know, living half naked in a jungle, and yet they're like Prince Philip in some sort of god way. Here's again. I can't get my head around how, how that came about, honestly. I want to tell you that the flag that we have raised here, you will be our defender. Now we will. Bit heavy, isn't it? I'm meant to be here to go on a desert island. Do they know I'm not powerful? I'm not a powerful figure. I'm just a bloke from England. We depend on you, so now you promise that everything will be good. Cool. What can I do? I mean, I don't go, what's, what's the main concern here? What, what are they worried about? I'm not quite sure. I mean, that's madness. When I was at school, my head teacher said, Carl will never be a high flyer. I'm suddenly part of the UN. Joining, sorting out the world problems and everything. That's not me, that. I mean, that's, I think I said the right thing, didn't I? They don't need to worry. Everything's going to be good. Things change, but I think... I think it'll be all right. I, I'd carry on as you are. It's a bit sort of something that Obama would say or something. It's quite sort of positive. I've always thought it'd be handy, having a volcano close to hand, just to get rid of, you know, old mattresses, old chest of drawers you don't want. It's a pain in the arse at home, isn't it, when you've got to call the council 25 quid a time? Chuck it in that big hole. I'd love that at home. Some sort of big burning hole that you just chuck stuff in. Is it, is it, is it good luck to throw anything in? Oh. You're not allowed? We are not allowed to throw in anything. What's the point in having it, then? Fucking hell. It's not gliding, though, is it? Yeah, man, I don't get the one-to-one-one. Look like a dog wiping its ass. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know why we're messing around so much, meeting all these tribes. I've met, I've met one, I've met a tribe. It better be different. If I get on there and there's a bloke with a, his knob in some wicker, I'll be annoyed. I've seen that. We here, it's a palm tree, but you say Nindin tip. Nindindim. Nindindip. That we usually eat the fruit, we call it naho. Naho? Yes. That one there, we call it nindi. It's all N? Yes. Everything all begins, begins with N? Everything begins with N. What's that? Uh, it's a leaf. We call That's it. That's See, it worries me. If tomorrow I wake up and they're going, oh, you're, you're a good sport, you drank the carver, you ate the pork, pop a pair of pants on. I'm not wearing them pants. I know Ricky kept going on about pants. <laughs> I don't know what the rules are. What happens if, if they say, yeah, I'll pop these on? These are a pair of the chief's underpants. It's a real privilege. I'm not putting on warm pants. And this morning, the tribe would like to honour your presence by presenting you with your own Nambas, native pants. I'm not, I'm not doing that. Child, see that over there? That, that would be your desert island, mate. Not as big as I thought. 
I was picturing the bounty advert. They've been conned again, haven't they? Pissing it down. I'm on my way over to a muffin. It's not even that far away, am I? I'm hardly escaping everyone, am I? I thought it's meant to be like in the middle of nowhere, peace and quiet. This wasn't what I expected, was it? So I think uh, at the end of the day, I think I'm entitled to change the rules a little bit. Put my coat on in a minute, because this isn't doing anything. In fact, I think I think my skirt's growing without that much rain. I'm not sure Ricky would be happy about this, Carl. I don't give a shit. There's no way he'd be putting up with this. In case you weren't able to sort of deal with your own company, he thought maybe you'd like a little um, little friend. Where's the old? <laughs> So that's all he gave me, is it? That. Well, what am I meant to do that? What's the point of that? Look at it. Look at it. It's just going to wind me up, that. Eggs on legs. It's an egg cup. I've had that out three times since I've been sat here in the pissing down rain. It annoys me now. That was the easy bit, sitting on a, sitting on a beach. It wasn't that easy, wasn't it wasn't. It was hardly a beach. There was no sand. It was all rocky, sharp stuff. I had to sleep on it, getting up my arse, in my kidneys, piercing the lung. It wasn't the comfiest night of my life. <laughs> oh. I sat down to do a crossword. It was something like, what's the American version of a prawn, which is shrimp. Now I've relaxed, I know the answer. At the time, I was struggling. Um, Ricky did say he wanted that football back. Got 36 hours on a plane to get back home. I'm carrying that as hand luggage. A little reminder of that little annoying face. He's not, he's not getting it. Typical, isn't it? Day I'm leaving, the sun comes out. It's a Pilkington look. <laughs> 